but I have spent 36 years in uh, hardcore steel industry. Um, see, let me share two occasions, which is very revealing. I was heading the steel plant HR functions. We had these youngsters joining fast batch by management trainees during my uh, heading the department. So one of the girls opted that she wants to be in the blast furnace. Any one of you who can understand blast furnace means working more than 2,000 degrees temperature, which I can stand. I can go there for 10 minutes. And everyone was looking uh, like uh, what she is speaking. Does she know what it is? I said, let us try. But I had my own apprehensions. Because when we have an industrial license problem, and that the place is a hot place for the industrial license, at any moment something can happen. So in the evening, I asked her. We posted her in the blast this, but I asked her, are you sure what responsibility you are taking? You have to rush dead of the night if there is a problem. I would be there, but you must be there. You are the real officer. She says, no issue. But over a period of three to four months, you see the impact. My industrialization issues started dying down there. And uh, to top it, when uh, President Dr. Kalam visited the plant, uh, we don't uh, decide where you would go. He said, I'll go to last Furnace. And she was the only person from the youngsters who got an opportunity to have a photo along with Dr. Kalam. And he opted. He said, I want to have a photo with her. Not with the managing director, not with anyone else. This one, she took that. It's a question of otherwise we have apprehension. We'll see fit in. We'll see what. Let me leave. And second thing, Tata still she said, I know about the Tata still things. Uh, sir, you know in working in the EA, safety is a major concern in the steel industry. So normally they are the late, there are a lot of lady workers in the Tata steel plant. So we had been, they had been through their trade unions and others persuading impress on these ladies because they, the Jharkhand is a people where they wear saris, not this thing. There is a concern that we should persuade them to come with the trousers and that. But the trade union raised their hands. We will not get into this cultural issues. But somehow, some of these personal officers who were quite close, they reached out to them. Can you believe this? What's wrong in it? We will wear the trousers. You will not, not find now any person, whether lady or gents, working inside the plant who is wearing saris. That's a thing which starts from the other side. We have a lot of perceptions, impressions, which are not based on facts. We must give them the opportunity, they will come up. Thank you so much for the opportunity.